Hi, I'm Janie, and I'm here at Moody Gardens with Roy, the assistant curator of fishes. Hi, Roy. Hi. How are you doing? I'm fine. How are you? All right. I have some questions for you. Okay. All right. Here we go. Why do our sharks not eat the other fish? Well, we keep our sharks well fed. Uh, we feed them four times a week, and uh, and they have uh, they can eat as much food as they want. And generally, they'll feed till they're they're full, till they're satiated. That means they've eaten enough where they're no longer hungry. And uh, so, hopefully, that will keep them from eating the other fish. What do you feed the sharks? Oh, they get a nice uh, nice menu of items. Um, uh, for instance, today we fed them squid and herring. Uh, they also got some capelin. Uh, they get salmon, they can get redfish, they get flounder, they get stingray, uh, they get uh, a little tunny, which is uh, a type of jack, they get creval jack, uh, sometimes they get blue runner. Good selection of things. Is the food live? No, no, not at all. It's uh, frozen food. All the food that we feed here, uh, not in, in the aquarium department, but is everywhere else on, at Moody, is all human grade food, so it's uh, restaurant grade food. How often do the sharks feed? Well, we feed them four days a week. Um, we offer them food, I should say. They don't always eat because uh, they're binge feeders usually. They'll eat a lot till they're full and then they may not eat for another week or so. Uh, but we always make sure that they have food available so if they do want to eat, they can. How do you feed the sharks? Well, very carefully. Uh, now we, uh, we use uh, poles. We have long uh, aluminum poles that have handles on them and, and they're tongs. And we can pick them up and then we present the food to the sharks as they swim by. Uh, if they want to eat the food, great. If they don't, they'll just keep swimming by. Are there any risks? No, not at all. Uh, there's no risk. I mean, unless, you know, somebody happens to fall in and fall on top of a shark, which I hopefully will never happen. But uh, no, there's no risk at all. Every once in a while, a shark will grab a pair of tongs out of one of the aquarist's hands and pull it into the tank, but that doesn't hurt anything. Do the sharks ever fight with each other over food? Uh, not really. I mean, sometimes you get two or three sharks that come in for the same piece of food and it gets a little crazy because they're all going for the same food, uh, but they really don't fight. Are there any cool stories you got to share with us? I think one of the neatest things that we've done in the aquarium department is when we had our uh, uh, five new sand tiger sharks that we received. Uh, they were out in the quarantine building and we had the opportunity to move those from quarantine into the aquarium. And uh, that can be a pretty challenging uh, uh, thing to do and uh, that was uh, pretty exciting for everybody involved. And it's just a matter of hopping in and grabbing them and moving them. Awesome, that's really cool. All right, well, thanks, Roy, for answering our questions, and see you next time. <laughs>